The following portion of daytime is sponsored by ImageLift. It is a new year and many people have weight loss goals they want to achieve. But have you noticed that sometimes when people lose weight around their waists, their faces change quite a bit too? Here to tell us more is ImageLift's double board certified plastic surgeon, Dr. Richard Castellano, and one of his satisfied patients, Cindy Taylor. Good to have you both here. Thank you, Cindy. Thanks for having us. Yeah. Cindy, you're in the process of losing some weight, huh? I tell am. us about that. Well, I started losing weight. I've lost 45 pounds. Congratulations. I would like to lose some more, but I was so discouraged. I didn't even enjoy my weight loss because my face was falling so fast. So really, what, what was happening? You just noticed that your once round face kind of went yes. south? Yes, yes. In the past, when I've gained and lost weight, it's always bounced back. Mm -hmm. Now, it's not bouncing back at all. So everything, the more weight I'd lose, the more it would sag. So is this common, Dr. Castellano, and people who lose a lot of weight? It's different for different people, depends on their anatomy, but when you lose weight, the face changes. So, you know, in her circumstance, when it didn't come back in, well, she came to be evaluated for image lift, and so uh, it makes more of a difference for some than others. Um, so, yeah, it, it is typical and it varies. And the way you found out more about Image Lift was you went to a seminar. Tell us about that. I did. That. I did. I saw um, an ad in the paper and it was discussing having a free consultation in Tarpon Springs and I live in Clearwater. Mm -hmm. So I decided to go and see what I thought. I was so impressed that I signed up that day, gave him a deposit, <laughs> signed up that day, never even told my significant other that Good I was you. even thinking about it. <laughs> and um, I've been happy ever since. Excellent. Well, Dr. Castellano, let's go through with Cindy's yeah, procedures. Let's take a look at her picture. So you can see here that we did the medium image lift, and you look at the neck and the jowl area, and the goal is that it looks natural, just tightening things up, and you really see the difference on the next view uh, on how her neck and jawline have improved. It's a big difference, and when you gain a lot of weight, the neck gets more full, and it sags down, and as we were talking about earlier, when you lose the weight, if it doesn't bounce back, then this is a great option. Uh, so that's what we did for her, and uh, we're about six weeks out now, mm -hmm. and we're really excited for you. Her uh, energy is great. She comes yeah. back into the office, and she's just... Mute. Actually, I feel totally different. Well, you look great. I really do. What was bothering you the most? My neck was bothering me the most. And then my eyelids uh, had, gotten, <laughs> had gotten so droopy that I wear eyeliner, and it would always get on the upper part of my eye <laughs> because my eyelids would droop over the eyeliner. So what was the actual uh, procedure for Cindy? And, and, we, and we trimmed the upper eyelid skin, and the medium image lift is what we did for her to tighten these areas. Let's talk about recovery time and, and how that went for you. Was it everything that you were expecting? It was better than I was <laughs> expecting. When I was signing in, a lady was just leaving, and I asked her, I said, did it hurt? And she goes, not even the injection. I can tell you that not one time did I have any pain. The worst part about the whole recovery was just keeping my head wrapped for two days. Mm -hmm. That was it. That was it. That was it. That and sleeping on an incline, you know, but after that, fine. And your I daughter? only took pain medication the first night oh. and after that, never again. Good for you. Yeah. Now, I understand your daughter's thinking about this. My daughter is thinking about this. She's uh, a teacher and we're of Irish descent and we're all following in my mother's footsteps. Mm -hmm. and. So yes, she's planning this in the next five to seven years, and probably. And you're encouraging her because you I think am. That you shouldn't have waited as long as you I did. I never should have. If he had been around, <laughs> I would have done this much, much sooner. <laughs> what did your hubby think of all this? Because you didn't tell him you were getting this done. Well, I did not tell him, and he was worried for my safety. Mm -hmm. And when we discussed it, um, he was fine. Good. And now he thinks that I look, quote, much better. <laughs> oh, isn't that sweet? Well, I think you look fantastic. And, Thank you. and just really quickly about these seminars, you've got more coming up, right? Absolutely. Check the website for the dates and times. We're all across the Bay Area. And you can find out questions like, I'm losing weight. When is the right weight to have this procedure done? Some can have it done even if you're not completely right. done with your weight loss mm -hmm. or when you're, before you start. And it can inspire you to achieve your weight loss goals when you love how your neck looks. Definitely. Okay, Dr. Costa. Delano and Cindy Taylor, thank you both thank very, you very much. Thank you for having us. You look wonderful. The eating portion of daytime was sponsored by ImageLift.